You want to call the police on them for having a barbecue on a Sunday? You're, you're I feel French! Back off! I'm going to tell them there's an African-American man threatening my life. Inside. We were you, you've been drinking? Control. Have you been at the game drinking? No, I no. said we were getting No, you drink. said you've been drinking. Thank you. This is white entitlement right here. I need your insurance, please. I'm giving you my insurance. I need your insurance. Thank you. Thank you for yes. being respectful. Okay. I, I appreciate that. I appreciate Thank that. You. I'm Okay. Or Indian or whatever. The I'm not Indian. You don't belong in America. I don't belong in America. Are you videoing? Yes, I am. I will be getting your license plate. I am videoing you. I guarantee you will probably lose whatever job you have for this. I'm sorry. You know what? Go you poke yourself. You should. Wow. You should. I mean, dude. I'm sorry. You have to. You have to witness this. This is. This is your own wife. I'm sorry for that. That husband is just a defeated soul. He's been married to their Karen uh, for a very long time. What, what do you think he's going to do? He has to go home to that. Let's put a picture up. She started yelling racial slurs against the individual. Now remember, they rear-ended her. They hit her. She was engaged in the conversation required after somebody hits you. I need your insurance information. The woman decided to become racist. The white male did not, but he said nothing to his wife. So her daughter, according to the narrative, and let's put the picture back up for a mask, her daughter was headed back to her college um, when the Gordons hit the daughter from behind with their truck, then put it in reverse and hit her again. After they gave her their info, they left before the police could be called. That's called a hit and run. That's why the picture is there for a mass. You got to get this handled. Okay. Yasmin, Karenicity runs deep here. What are your thoughts? Yeah, the husband, I mean, he just seems like he just wants this all to be over. And it's like you just want to tell him there's a better way to live, man. None of his wife's words or actions were necessary. But it's funny because she's like gatekeeping Americanism as a white person. And she lives in Iowa. And I don't know <laughs> if Iowa sounds like a white European centric right. word to her. But I, where does she think the word Iowa came from? I'm just saying. Great point. Welcome to Indisputable. I'm your host, Dr. Rashad Richard. We got a lot happening today. But what do we do on this show? We tell the truth. You know why we tell the truth? Because the truth is simply indisputable. Rashad, great to be here. Congratulations on the new show. And I got to let everybody know that Rashad and I go way back. People still need health care, so I won't stop. People still need criminal justice systems reform throughout this country, so I won't stop. And you won't stop either.